Today we're going to talk about inverters and their low voltage disconnects, or LVD for short. Most inverters have low voltage disconnects that are meant to protect the inverter, but the Perky's inverter is meant to protect the tractor. As I mentioned previously, all inverters have a low voltage disconnect. Typically this is down in the 8 volt, 9 volt range. At this point, tractor batteries are so discharged they're not going to have enough power to crank the motor. The Perky's inverter has a programmable LVD. The benefit to this is the ability to choose at which voltage input level we shut off the inverter. For example, a 12.3 volt low voltage disconnect will allow the driver to enjoy his end cap comforts while protecting the vehicle and allowing enough power to crank the motor. Now as a demonstration, this is a 12.3 LVD Perky's inverter. Uh, right now our input power is at about 12.5, but I'm going to demonstrate what happens when we drop below the 12.3 shutoff. Now if we drop below that 12.3, this light will begin to flash letting you know that it's below that input voltage of 12.3 and after 30 seconds the inverter is going to shut off. Now this light is blinking red showing that the inverter shut off due to a low voltage disconnect. To be able to get the inverter to turn back on, the driver has to start the truck, the inverter has to see an input voltage higher than 13.3 volts and then he's going to have to flip this power switch to be able to get to turn back on. The Perky's inverters with programmable LVDs allow the driver to enjoy his in-cab comforts while protecting the tractor's electrical system, especially the batteries, and avoiding costly jump stops.